Husker fans, Sam McEwen with the Omaha World Herald and Husker Extra. This is our Big Ten offseason update for the Iowa Hawkeyes. Yes, your favorite team. Uh, Iowa has gotten better on offense in the offseason. Cade McNamara, uh, the Michigan quarterback who led the Wolverines to the college football playoff in 2022, 2021, is uh, now Iowa's quarterback, and he's going to be a heck of a lot better than the two guys they were using last year. And that was a big issue for Iowa last year because their defense was out of this world. Um, offensively, Iowa will be better. Their offensive line will be more seasoned. They added a few receivers to replace the guys they lost, and I think they'll be pretty good at running back. They're always good at special teams. You can always count on that with Iowa. Iowa's defense is probably going to take a step back. It's just hard not to see it happening. When you lose a first-round pick in Van Ness on the defensive line, you lose a first-round pick in Jack Campbell at linebacker, and then you lose some elite guys in the secondary, it's going to take a little bit of time. Iowa's system is very, very, um, what do you want to call it, sturdy and effective. So you don't have to worry about Iowa being terrible on defense. But there are some pieces that they're going to have to replace there. I could see them taking a half step back. Big game early in the season against Iowa State. Iowa State, you know, Matt Campbell needs to figure things out there. If Iowa wins that one, I think they're going to be in great shape to win the Big Ten. I, I think it's probably going to be between Iowa, Wisconsin, and Minnesota to see who wins that Big Ten West. And I think McNamara's addition will help the Hawkeyes a lot. Okay, that is our offseason update for Iowa.